What's up y'all, I'm Jordy, and today I've got a best of three versus Chawarzard. On the screen right now is the team I'm using, uh, and Chawarzard hasn't made a rental code as of recording this, uh, but if he does, I'll be sure to put that in the description as well, along with the paste of this team. Uh, basically, the real quick of it is coaching up Calyrex, heal up Calyrex with hospitality, maybe put up Trick Room, sweep with the Ice Horse. Alright, let's just jump right into it. All right, we've got Chawarzard here, Terrapagos, Cloak, Standard Call Mindset, Comfe, Mental Herb, uh, basically Standard Stuff, Terra Steel, the Terras won't matter much, Fake Out, Flare Blitz, Will-O-Wisp, Parting Shot on that Incin with Goggles, uh, Scarf Urshifu, Sash Fluttermane, No Gleam, uh, Icy Wind Taunt, No Protect either, uh, Fake Out, Glide, Wood Hammer, High Horsepower, Standard, Rillaboom, okay. My biggest fear is Will-O-Wisp, and I can't use Rage Powder against it. That kind of sucks. But I need to get Calyrex set up one way or another. So I'm, Cal I'm going Calyrex and Valiant on lead. That'll get me Taunt into either Terrapagos or Incineroar, or anything really. Um, I guess my worst fear would then be a Fluttermane lead, maybe? But they can't taunt both, so I'm gonna get a boost. Um, outside of that... I think... Healing would be important, so I want Sinistra. I don't want to have to Terra. And then I think speed control's not that important here. I might just want Incineroar. Yeah, I think I want Incineroar. Uh, it might be Ogre Pond is a little better there. Especially because of the Terrapagos being cloaked. Oh, that's a good card. Yeah, I kind of ran out of time picking my last. I know the three I want. I don't know about the last one. And it is a Fluttermain lead. Okay. Fluttermain on lead with Sash, Icy Wind... Shadow Ball, Moonblast, Taunt, Terrapagos. So Terrapagos' ability goes before a nerve even. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. They're not going to appreciate a Glacial Lance. And I think they would want to taunt my Valiant, actually. So I think I want a Swords Dance. And hit a Spirit Break on Fluttermane. Okay, a swap. I like that. Into Comfe. The Sociable. Nice. Oh, you taunt the Calyrex? Okay, that's fine. I'll remember that for best of three. Good damage. I'll take it. All right, now I'm happy to throw a Lance, because you don't really have much that can take that. You might taunt my Valiant. Do I want to go for a Coaching anyway? Glacial Lance. I'm not too worried about anything Comfey can do. So honestly, I'm, just, I'm happy to just throw a Glacial Lance and swap into Hobbs here. That'll give me a Fake Out turn, uh, but not into Terrapagos. But maybe into Terrapagos just to break the shell. Uh, I, I think they might taunt this slot, especially because Fluttermane seems to be staying in. Yeah, Draining Kiss. Oh, it's probably a double up into Valiant then. Yeah, they wanted to get rid of Valiant. That makes sense. Well, I get rid of Fluttermane. Comfey takes over half. I'll take it. That's awesome. And I get a plus one boost. Looking good. Looking very good. Uh, the worst thing to see would be Incineroar. Okay, Terrapagos is fine. Have not seen your last. 
feel like if it was Incineroar, it would have come out there. Might be Rillaboom. Um, could be Urshifu. Either way, I know I'm going to click Glacial Lance here. 100%. And then I'm thinking of using Fake Out just to break the shell. I don't think I KO at plus one, even if I break the shell, though. So I'm thinking maybe Parting Shot would be better. No, I'm going to Fake It Out. Comfey uses Protect. Okay. Just a double Protect to get rid of my Fake Out turn? No, it's not a double Protect to get rid of my Fake Out turn. Cool. I get to break the shell and you go for Call Mind. That makes sense. That I understand. Yeah, that play makes a lot of sense because... I don't know if you can heal up to full though. Because I think this does over half. Yeah, you can try to heal, but you're not going to get ba back to full. Yeah, you can chip with... Yeah, you, you just protected Comfey, so I'm going to take Comfey if you try to protect Terrapagos here. And then probably a parting shot would be best. Just get something else in. Glacial Lance... I'm going to go Flare Blitz. Because with the extra health they're going to get from Terra, I don't think... I think Glacial Lance plus Flare Blitz might do it. E like, I'm assuming that this is a side Floral Healing. I assume they Floral Healing. And then... The Double Up... The, the Double Up might do it. Might. It's going to be close. Wow, they get a lot back from that. Because when you change forms, any of the new HP just gets added. It doesn't... Like, if you're at half health, you don't only get half of your health back. You get all of it back that you would gain from changing form. Alright, I eat my citrus. That is not much damage, oh my goodness. Oh, uh, but at least Comfey is going to be out of here. Yeah, Terrapagos eats that. It should have been a parting shot. My bad, Ensign. My bad. Or at least a knockoff. Alright, well, you're not going to heal anymore. You've got your Incineroar in. It's okay, I've got the clear amulet. Now, you'd go for a fake out on Calyrex. No, you bait Calyrex. You that you don't fake out Calyrex. No, I, I need to not overthink this because they're gonna call mind. They have goggles on their Incineroar. That's a problem. All right, I'm going to try this. If you, if you fake out Incineroar and go for a Calm Mind, that's a great play. Okay, it's just Star Storm. That's fine, I think. Yeah, I think that should be okay. Yeah, just going for a Will-O-Wisp. Got it. Okay. I've got Wide Guard with Iron Valiant. I've got Trick Room with Sinistra. Yeah, honestly, Sinistra Trick Room might be the play here.
Like, should I even care about the Will-O-Wisp? I'm at plus two attack. Honestly, I'm just gonna Glacial Lance and Trick Room. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm, I'm not. I shouldn't be that worried. Because yeah, you protect and then you burn my Calyrex probably. Yeah, but that's okay. I can still take out Terrapagos. And cause your Incineroar some problems. Because now I'm free to Terra the Ice Horse. Your attack is Flare Blitz. Yeah, that's fine. I'm running low on those Glacial Lances. Uh, I'll Glacial Lance... No. I will Terra... Glacial Lance. Bring in Iron Valiant. Sinistra isn't going to do anything to Incineroar. So getting it out so I can heal Calyrex back up later is what I need to be doing. Yeah, this is fine. I got this. Just got to play it meticulously. There is the wet horse and the glacial lance. It does enough. It does a good amount of damage to Incineroar too, if I'm being honest. And then Flare Blitz. Oh, Flare Blitz was into the Sinistra slot, so that's something. Yep, and then I'll just throw another Lance and bring in Sinistra. Probably a forfeit here, yeah. Good game, Chawarzard. That was a fun one. Terrapagos is super cool. Let's go on to game two. Okay, here we are, game two. Uh, my plan game one worked pretty well. I do need to be careful. Hmm. Because that taunt lead is kind of annoying. I guess I could Rage Powder and Swords Dance, but that would leave me vulnerable to an Incineroar lead. Um, Calyrex is definitely what I use, though. Calyrex... I still like Calyrex, Valiant, Sinistra, Incineroar. I, I don't think there's anything wrong with that. I think I will use this game to see what Chawarzard changes up. Just do the exact same plays and see what see what happens there. Yeah, I think that should be alright. Alright. Let's see what you got this time. Let's see if the change up can get me. If you're going to change up what you bring at all. Like, you could just change up how you play. Incin Fluttermane? Yeah, that makes sense a lot. That makes a lot of sense. Get the burn on Calyrex as soon as possible. Yeah, and you can taunt my taunt, even, if you wanted. Um... <sighs> Fake Out and Hitting Iron Valiant would be a good play. I'm going bold. I'm going to Swords Dance. And I'm going to try to taunt Ensign. Okay, they didn't go for a fake out. It's a sh that Shadow Ball did a lot, though. Can't Will O Wisp after the taunt. Awesome. Okay, I'm happy with that. I'm going to protect Calyrex now and hit a Spirit Break into Fluttermane. That's what I'm going to do. 
The withdrawal into Sinistra might be a little telegraphed. Um, I'm also scared that I may be forced to burn Terra too early. Whoa, is that a Terra? Yo, okay. Alrighty. Terra Fairy, that must be Moonblast? Yeah, go, gonna try to KO Calyrex even through Terra here. Or through uh, Sinist <clears throat> through Terra and bringing in Sinistra. I can respect that play. Didn't work though. And now that means you're not gonna Terra Terrapagos, which is awesome. Okay, I think I'm going to give up the plus two attack. Because Valiant will swap out first. I can heal it with Sinistra and then get out into Incineroar. Yeah. So it's a double swap. Valiant comes out. Sinistra comes in. And then I get my Incineroar in. And we're looking good. Just playing real careful here. Because I don't... I, it doesn't matter if I Terra now. I can Terra freely. And maybe I should have just burned Terra there and try to Oko Incineroar. Yeah. Playing careful here may get me punished. but I should now have a fake-out Trick Room if I want it. Yeah, I think I do want it. Hmm. Maybe I should have just burned Terra there and taken out Insin. I don't know. Yeah, just Shadow Ball. You, you know I have Mental Herb, so Taunt isn't going to do it. Cineroar flinches, and I get my tricky room. Now the problem is Sinistra is probably going to move after Incineroar. Kind of makes sense to leave Fluttermane on the field now that it's minus one. Incin two. Yeah, believe it or not, I'm going to start stalling my own Trick Room. I got myself into a little bit of an awkward position here. <laughs> Now, maybe I should have just Rage Powdered, trying to... Oh, okay. Going after that slot. Might have been predicting a parting shot there. Thinking I would go first. My Incineroar is actually faster, it looks like. Yep. Get rid of those goggles. Just a Shadow Ball, that's fine. Incineroar will go first, then I can Parting Shot out, and then if Iron Valiant's still around, I can hit Fluttermane. And I don't think Flare Blitz will take Iron Valiant from here, so I think that's the way it'll go. Incin will do whatever, I'll Parting Shot, take out Fluttermane, then I'm in with the Ice Horse, then I'm happy. All right, let's see it. Fluttermane swap. Okay. Into Urshifu. I'll take that. That's fine with me. 
and a parting shot from Insin. Okay. Depending on who this is, I might switch who I'm going into, honestly. Um, Urshifu is going to take some damage. A lot of damage, actually. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm jolly, but I'm nearly max attack on this thing. And they do have Terrapagos. It's going to take a special attack drop, though. So it's not too threatening. Let's get a drop on you. It does have Calm Mind and... Starstorm. Yeah, I think I want to go into Calyrex. Hopefully this puts the uh, Urshifu into Glacial Lance range. That would be awesome. Might be. In fact, since you're Scarf, I think I'm just going to high horsepower you. No point in terastalizing. And I'll bring in Sinistra. Sinistra walls Terrapagos pretty hard. If it can't Terra. Because it just has normal move and earth power. Yep, heal up a little bit more. Urshifu swap. Well, there's a high horsepower going there, so... Hi, Ensign. Bye, Ensign. Um, from that range, it's a chance to live. Depends on how bulky they are. And... It takes it. Awesome. I have not been counting the Trick Room turns. But I have Rage Powder, and you only have single target moves left. So, I should be okay. And Trick Room didn't end there. Okay. Back to Urshifu. Fine by me. Last turn of Trick Room. Urshifu cannot protect. I think I should just Glacial Lance, try to try to hit Terrapagos there. And Strength Set my own Calyrex. Aqua Jet, just for a little chip. Okay, uh, no Protect from the Terrapagos is interesting. I guess you didn't really need to Protect there. Get my attack sky high. And then sap it. Which gets blocked. But still heals. In case you didn't know, that's how that goes. Alright, then a Calm Mind from Terrapagos, that's fine. All you have left is Fluttermane and... Oh, I guess you could taunt. No, you can't. I have Mental Herb. Yeah, you're not getting around this. Uh, unless Fluttermane can Oko Sinistra. Which might have been your plan, but you didn't know I was going to be back at full health. Glacial Lance. Um. Glacial Lance. I don't want to Terra Sinistra because I want to take the Star Storm. I guess it's fine too, right? Yeah, because the Fluttermane Shadow Ball will come first. Then I take that out. Yeah, this should be fine. I think this is right. And then the Glacial Lance should be able to take out the Fluttermane. I don't know about taking out Terrapagos from here. I think last time I hit it... No, no, I don't think it does. Like, I'm a little stronger than last time. But... And the shell's broken, but I don't think it's enough. I think it'll eat this. Okay, so this... Oh, special defense drop. Oh, we take it! Yes! Good job, Sinistra. 
Beautiful eat. And they both go down. Let's go. Cali Ice is unmatched. Whew. I love this ice horse. I loved the ice horse before it had a rider. Now, just give Glastrier Glacial Lance and we can talk because that's all it needs. Good game, Chawarzard. Super fun. All right, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like on this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'm gonna be posting all of the best of threes for this tour, so stay tuned or go back and watch them. But anyways, I'm Jordy, and uh, all right, peace.